Well, we are heading over to take a feed um, from what's exactly that address of uh, King, the new monarch King Charles III will be. But before we do that, let's go to our first story. Information Class News has gathered this evening indicates that the Agbogomefia of Asogli State, Togwe after the 14, chased out MP for Asin Central, Kennedy Ohini Ejepon, when the latter went to pay homage to the revered king at his palace in Ho as part of the Sogliam Festival. Reasons for that Bubomefia's posture is still scanty. However, it's being attributed to past insulting pronouncements made by the said MP against the personality of that Bubomefia of a Sogli state, Togbe Apede the 14. This was after the then president of the Volta Regional House of Chiefs. Togbe Apede the 14th bemoaned the attitude of the new Patriotic Party administration, accusing them of treating Volterians as outsiders. Well, we're trying to connect with the Asafo Fiachiami Jade of Bankwe uh, in the Sogli state for uh, more on this particular event that took place, we understand, a while ago. The videos are also on our social media platform. You can get to watch that. But of course, Asafo Fiachiami uh, Jade of Ho Bankwe is on the line. Good evening. Good evening, can you hear me? Right. Can you confirm that it uh, truly talk about further the 14th? Can you hear me? One minute for me. Eh? Oh, uh, yeah, I can. I am here. I can hear you. Very well. Please, can you confirm to our listeners and to the public that talk about further indeed chased out the MP for Asin Central Kennedy Ohini Japan? What can I say? We are still enjoying the good times here in Hubankwe. The Yam Festival is on and everything is going on well. We have not even, you know, we, we are not done with today's program yet. However, I'm receiving several calls from several courses talking about uh, social media circulations that talk about the has back Kennedy, Kennedy Japan and all that. Um, I don't know what to say. He hasn't given me permission to speak on his behalf, but I... Uh, I'm not sure the way it's being couched is how it's circulating. But I, I can only say that he came here though. But then it's just that we had um, a very tall list of representations and representatives from uh, uh, other uh, groups. I see. Trying to explain what exactly happened. Uh, uh, but before you go on, uh, Toby, I just want you to know that we have videos as well of that one, particularly on our stage. So let's uh, hear you. I am. Uh, I am delighted that you called me. We are still in procession mm. with the uh, with Togo Gang for the okay. 14. A lot today. We've had a lot of visitors coming in all over from all companies, all institutions, corporate organizations that are resident in Ho and uh, chiefs from other places have also visited us. We had a lot of time today with our, uh, with, with ourselves, and so. Um, I, I want to say I thank everybody who tried as much as possible to be here to celebrate with us. Tomorrow is a grand ceremony. Uh, we wish that all will be here to grace the occasion for us. Going forward on the matter, um, when he came, I received him, actually. I received Honorable Kennedy in Japan to go and greet the chiefs. And then we found a place for him to sit. And then we got them water and others. And so um, uh, I was the one who was prompted to tell the, the MC that uh, he has another program at UPSA at five, and that if we could keep him so that he will be announced and then his donations and gifts will be received before he, ran, he goes away, that would be fine. So I also say I'll, I'll take the matter to the seniors or the people who are on the high table. So we told them, and the organizers were like, every other person who came to the program was equally important, or is equally important, you understand me? And that people have been sitting, organizations have been sitting since morning, some like Bank of Ghana, some like Ghana Commercial Bank, a prison, a Institute Artillery Regiment, and other institutions, which it has not gotten to their case. And so if we should just keep him, which on normal grounds will not spoil anything, but thinking that other people will be offended by the fact that they, they gave favoritism to him will not be 
proper. The Asafo or Asafo or all the the drumming and dancing groups were with him. In fact, the municipal chief Asafo Fiat, can you can you can you hear me, Togwe? So what it yeah. means is that what I get is that you are being diplomatic with the issue. I want to know whether or not no, because I sat there throughout. Yes. What happened last minute was that we 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 he, he was it was not possible to spend. But they realized that they were getting late. Mm -hmm. So they decided to just move away. Okay. So I'm saying that, is it true or not that, that Togbega had turned away the MP? No, yeah, he was not turned away. Is he it true not, that he was he, chased he was out? He away. Togbega just said that. He didn't even say anything. Togbega waited. Please, Class FM, get this one right. Mm -hmm. Togbega didn't sack him. Togbega allowed him so that he could get to his stand. We that, saw, that, where, that where were the drinks and the things packed? Uh, why were, was it packed from the palace outside? He was not packed, so I beg you. No, the packed. packed, why were the drinks, the gifts he brought? No, they packed them away because they realized we were, we were delaying them. So they, they decided to walk away with their drinks and all that. See? So, uh -huh, because all the people who came, the institutions, what they presented it themselves like one on one. So, Asafo Fia, tell me what you are saying is that I brought a drink, I brought some gifts to uh, a chief, a revered king like Togbega, only for me to ask for time. I was not giving. I pack away my gift. That's enough disrespect even to the throne, is it not? Oh, no, you. Uh, we, we we didn't send him away. You see, that is why we are not getting right to. We didn't turn him away. We wanted to see. Look at the time we are finishing. Look at the time we are finishing. I brought an institution called Confucius Institute. When they got here, we were the last people to announce ourselves. And we, we, we could only present even two bottles of Shinap. So it was not that they sat him. I see. Uh -huh. I see. We're, we're grateful for your time. Well, we we'll allow the public to go to go back to our Facebook live stream, Class Ninety One Point Three FM, and all the images and the videos we have, and they could go watch. Thank you very much. Well, it's a bit scanty in terms of what exactly the issues are, but what we learned is, or what we can say is that if you recall, uh, the firebrand MP has been on some uh, trajectory of. Uh, uh, Pouring out some insulting pronouncements um, on the uh, revered king. I say, I do say this in the studio. We're trying to connect with the Asafofia Chiami, and uh, some uh, we, we cannot get him. What do you make of this particular one? If the uh, reports you are picking uh, it's uh, confirmed uh, as true, uh, it will be a very huge posture. Uh, one that sends clear signals uh, from the uh, Asogli state regarding that particular situation but of course it would also raise questions about some of our politicians and of course the uh, statements they often make which then it turns out to be uh, swept to the back burner whenever they want to go onto the public platforms and push in a phase of a more or less uh, mm. reconciliation I see we have the videos uh, showing on our social media page, our Facebook live stream, Class 91.3 FM. So for those of you who want to watch that, uh, where they were packing, uh, seemingly packing the items uh, the Firebrand MP uh, Kennedy Japan had brought in to pay homage uh, to the chief. And so for those of you who want to watch, you could go there and watch. But the, the issues of, uh, I, I had heard that earlier today, or yesterday, I don't know how that is true. Uh, he had made some pronouncement also on Net2 TV or one of his stations, especially one that sounded insulting. Uh, people have also said that uh, the Agbogwenthia and other chiefs are a bit receptive of some of these things, unlike, if you like, Asantehine and co. What should be the posture going forward for the chiefs especially? Well, in line with the issues of more or less what you would call diplomacy, I, one side of me admires what has transpired, if it is indeed true. Uh, it is about time our uh, traditional leaders begin to assert their influence, that they will not condone and countenance such statements from politicians 
at the public arena and secretly tend to more or less uh, link up with them on issues of mutual interest, they must begin to assert themselves. And this is a good, a good way for me. But on the other side of the diplomatic uh, uh, table, where people are supposed to be humane, uh, contain such outbursts from politicians, one people will describe as part of their freedom of speech, uh, of expression and putting out their opinions, we must begin to hint on the fact that yes, no matter how huge your freedoms are, you must be measured when dealing with some of these traditional leaders because they hold clout, they hold influence, and when it matters, and when it matters, they can't hit you hard. I see. So again, those videos are on our Facebook live stream, uh, Class 91.3 FM on Facebook. And you can also connect uh, with that. I've had some messages uh, there, uh, with especially with regards to that. Hello, Koku. Ken Kennedy Japan should have been apprehended and given some lashes for insulting the revered chief of Asogli State. That's Prosper sending that one in from uh, Dawenya. Uh, also from Victor Class FM. Uh, good evening, class of and well done, Toby Apple, for exhibiting your authority to our admiration. Our chiefs must take, uh, be taken seriously. I wish the people of Asogli State a happy, happy Yam Festival as we climb us it this week and hashtag 505 you say. Uh, also, uh, good evening, Koku. The Asogli State's refusal to throw out Honorable Kennedy Pohar of the Chief Palace is in the right. So it's not a refusal. They actually, what we are getting is that he was thrown out and is the best you said it's the best thing to do and served as a lesson to the MPP loyalists and uh, the party people. Uh, well, there's a bashing here for us. Okay, no. Uh, hello, Koku. Why are we falling over ourselves on the death of the Queen of England? Ghana has been plunged into an economic crisis, and here we are talking about the death of someone. PM Don uh, Pram Pram sends that particular uh, one in well uh, we are not falling over the death indeed we are part of commonwealth nations we competed in the commonwealth games and so we cannot also pretend